All right, y'all, welcome to another video by VA Music Ministry. We have Brother Jaden Arnold here. Actually, minister, pastor, aren't you a pastor? A worship pastor. Wor he's a worship pastor. Let me put some respect on <laughs> that name. Worship pastor, Jaden Arnold, he's going to be uh, giving us some preaching chords. Yeah, with Mark Moore, Elder Mark Moore. Let me put some respect on his name, Elder Mark Moore Jr. Uh, with that being said, let's get started with a word of prayer real quick. Father God, we love you, we thank you, we honor you. We ask, Father God, that you just be in this tutorial. Uh, continue to bless, lead, and guide like only you can. In Christ Jesus' name we do pray. Amen. All right. Let's play the clip. Let's see. Let's get busy. I'm playing along with this? Yeah, or this is just you. Done? This is just you. Tell somebody uh, that if you jump down uh, to verse number 57, uh, I, uh, it says that months have now gone by. Uh, Elizabeth's full time came that she should be delivered and she brought forth a son in other words that's really good news all by itself because it's confirmation for somebody that God always does what he says I need you to go ahead and lean over and talk to somebody real quick and say neighbor 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 say God Always comes through. You don't have the right name, but talk to somebody else and say he may not come when you want him to, but say he always comes through. Lord, I wish I had a witness in here. Let me just wave your hand and say he may not do it the way I want, but say he. Always, he always comes through. Lord, can I preach a little while? The Bible says that they have the baby, and they're at the house party, and it's the eighth day, and they're getting ready to circumcise him. Lord, can I preach? I wish I had somebody that would help me here. I'm trying to find the right safe example to help me make my point here. I wish I had maybe. I need a married couple to come help me. Because I don't want no stuff to get started. I know who I use. Come here, Dove family. That's exactly who I need. The Bible says that Elizabeth and Zachariah. Y'all are just who I needed. They have the baby. And they're at the party now. And everybody in the family. They says let's go ahead. And dedicate baby Zachariah. But look at what Elizabeth says. She says no, 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 no. His name is not Zachariah Jr. And this is where we got to pause. Because in this day and age. It was custom. Mary to name the little boy after his daddy and so everybody thought that he would be Zachariah but Elizabeth says she says his name is gonna be John and they got an attitude and said why in the world don't you see that attitude? Why in the world would you name him John? The Bible says, they said, nobody in your family has that name. Nobody in your family has ever been called John. But that's what I want to tell somebody. I need you to look at a neighbor and say, neighbor, neighbor, neighbor. I'm getting ready to produce something that's never existed in my family. So say, I, I can't call it what I've already seen. Because God's getting ready to do a new thing in my house. Y'all ain't gonna have no church. 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 But is there anybody in here? Maybe the old man that can get some hands on the tiles and rub it in real. 
feel good And why don't you just lean over And grab your neighbor by the hand And say Lord, send me some preaching members. Please tell your neighbor. I don't know about you, but I'm getting ready to produce something that eyes haven't seen and ears haven't heard. You know my story, but say you don't know my future. There's something in me you ain't seen before. They said, why in the world? Oh, that's it. That's it. Oh, my God. Do you need a break? <laughs> oh, it's always fun having Jaden in the studio. Okay, all right. I don't even know. Look, y'all got the midi. We're going to have to slow this all the way down, Jaden. Look, I was not expecting you uh, on the part. So, for one, for one, let, let's, let's get to business. Elder Mark Moore, what style of preaching would you say he has? Mm. Pentecostal, apostolic, apostolic, in the little tad of Baptist. Baptist. So mm-hmm. yeah, so I was gonna say he's got a, a smidgen of, of Baptist in there. Yeah, but he, he's definitely apostolic, mm-hmm. like a like a Brandon Jacobs mm-hmm. at that apostolic feel, mm-hmm. uh, which is a powerhouse, and that apostolic feel is a little different. So you play behind him a little different than you play behind E. Dewey Smith, correct? Yeah. Okay. So with Elder Mark Moore, what is your approach? And, and this is good tips if anybody out there ever plays, which, you know, I doubt. But, I mean, I'm not saying I doubt, but it could happen. So what would you say your approach would be? Um, It's still along the lines of the three, four, up five. Okay. A lot of time he'll sing lines that he'll want you to play. Um, doesn't mean you have to catch every last one of them so it doesn't become too, too, too busy. Right. But it's still that three, four, up five. Did he have a conversation with you about making sure you follow certain things? No. Did Are you just new from I just, yeah. From Everything. Hearing, so nobody ever had to say, hey, Jaden, he likes to do such and such. Matt never mm-hmm. said, hey, he likes to do this one thing. Mm-hmm. You just already I knew I just that. had to catch those. Mm-hmm. So you didn't even, so nobody had to tell you. You just knew. Yeah. Okay, so let's, let's go into it. I, I want to look at, the sk- we're in E flat, right? Mm-hmm. Does he have perfect pitch? Because he always seems to go right to E flat. <laughs> I'm just wondering. Maybe not perfect pitch, but he does. He like, knows always what find that E flat. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he yeah. finds that E flat like yeah. he has perfect pitch. So yeah. let's let's go over the scale E flat just real quick. E flat's the one, F is the two, G is the three, A flat is the four, B flat's the five, C is the six, D is the seven. Back at E flat with the one. All right. With that being said, let's go over. Uh, what do you just three things you can play over the one? Okay, that's one. All right, break it down real quick. Okay. Uh, give me one more thing. Ooh, do it again. All right, now let. Do you ever? Did you ever go to E? Mm-hmm. No. Okay, let's go to F. Let's go ahead and go to F. Give us a few things. No, 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 not the key of F. Okay. Let's go. What you gonna play over the two? Should I say? All right. Okay. Now I see you go to F sharp. I know you went to F sharp. All right. Okay. Let's let's do that transition. Let's just say your goal is to get to the three. I notice sometimes. From where? It, huh? From so where? you're on the one and your goal is to get to the three. Right? Mm-hmm. Sometimes you didn't go just directly to the three. You play a series of chords again. All right, let's break it down. So you did go to the E. I knew you threw the E in there. You, done play, okay. you played every note of the scale. Every note, <laughs> all 12 notes you played. All right, so that's one way to get to the three. Show me a different way. Mm-hmm. 
All right, break so it down like real a quick. Walk down from plateau. All right, so let's let's do it from the one and do it in context. Ooh, yeah. oh. All right, what'd you go to? So let's break it down real quick. All right. Now show me a couple things we can do over the four. <laughs> 